So here's a brief video on how to do the firmware update on one of these um, Checkmate monitors. It's currently off. I only have the power supply plugged in and yes, I do have one of the early models where that power switch button is the wrong way around. It is indeed off. Firmware update came with this nifty PDF to show you what exactly needs to be done. So get a FAT32 formatted USB drive, which is what we have here. The file is at the root of this flash drive. Monitors off into USB socket next to the HDMI output port. I don't have my labels on here yet, but I do have a copy of the manual. So HDMI out is this one here. And so we should plug, plug it in to this one here. So we'll do that. USB stick is in and now it says, turn on the power slot, zero power switch. Do not turn it off. And then once the logo appears, all is complete. So slot zero is that bottom one. Let's do that. And then let's turn this around. It's currently pretending to be an IBM. Blinky blinky, various blinking patterns here. Seems to be doing something and here we go. Now, I don't know if there's a way to verify that it does indeed have the new firmware on it, but that would be nice to be able to show it here. Um, but anyway, we'll just trust that it's done. Actually, I do have one way to verify that the update worked. I did upgrade this thing here, model 80. <laughs> to an XGA2 video card that the previous um, firmware, it would just not display anything. But as you can see here, it's now perfectly happy to through the VGA output. And this is where some of the firmware fixes were addressing um, is now showing the output from that XGA card. That's well, not in this, but in the one underneath. So that makes me happy. Seems the firmware update worked and all is hunky-dory.